Hey folks, this is Noble Rambler and welcome back to RimWorld where I have got everybody working like slaves right now. I've spent the last 20-30 minutes just min-maxing and getting everybody set up to haul and although Tomislav is going to sneak out and rest, um, get as much stuff moved in as possible. We're down to just a couple of pieces left here and there that uh, everyone's queued up to take care of. Um, got Alicia to get all the mining done in here, set up walls. Um, Alicia, actually you are resting. How about you give me just a little more time. Their moods are great right now. I'm taking full advantage of their attended party and all that kind of stuff and killed someone. Plus 13. She's got the, uh, the bloodless characteristic. In fact, um, Gnarly brought that up that she would be the best one to have moving these bodies instead of Cathra, who is getting the negative 3 from Observed Corpse. Cathra, instead, how about you build this grave and build that grave and build that grave and that grave. You're not... There's the, the next one. Negative five. Um, did that work? Oh, plus two. It's there, but it's not giving me a line that shoots across this time. That's strange. And in that case, Alicia could haul body. Very Vera. Okay. And when you're done... Although there's only one open grave right now. Okay. So, Alicia can take care of those. We'll just kind of micromanage her into that. Who else is going away that doesn't absolutely need to? Needs. Tomasov's still in great shape there. What can I get him to do? Just a few more things before he goes to bed. Um, you can haul these in. So, haul that and haul that. No, not after you rest, though. Before you rest. Let's try that again. There and there. Okay. And that's not what I messed up with Kaptha, right? No, she's doing her job there. Okay, so who else? Um, just kind of watch everyone right now. Shantigo is on his way to get some more steel. Shantigo and Handy have got great run speeds right now, so I'm sending him down here to get all the steel and get it hauled in. Rabbit just about got to his bed, and I think I'll let him. I've worked him hard. Um, I would like to get these walls built for Sangria, if that's possible. Um, actually, Tomislav may have been the best one. His run speed right now is still, well, it's 5.75. It's slowed down a bit, probably because he's so close to needing a rest. But I could have him throw this stuff in here real quick. Tomislav, let's change your plans to um, install that. And who else down here can quickly move those? Um, Alicia is busy. Tomislav's busy. Klaus, you're busy grabbing that one. Okay. So, that's about everybody else. Michael snuck away. These two are still working. And Rabbit got to bed. Okay, Natalia is making clothes so that we can replace some of the ones we've damaged. And we've used up a lot of our stuff. Although, all this new stuff in the storage is really going to skew things. Let me kind of make up for that. We're bringing in yet a... Klaus had a parka. That doesn't count. And we've had the tribal wear. So, those don't count. So, Bill's... We've kind of shut down everything but. So let's make sure, yeah, the one pants, the one t-shirt, uh, and the one cowboy, two cowboy hats. Um, do two more times, I see. Duster's fine, and toques. Let's just make sure that we've got one more good toque available. Everyone's got one, but uh, who knows what we're going to need. Okay, so you're going to load all these up. Sangria's eating. And you're doing those. Tomislav, you're going to haul that granite chunk. Sangra, as soon as you're done, you're going to haul that granite chunk. And as soon as Tomislav gets out here, he's going to haul that granite chunk. And Catherine's going to grab a meal right there. And then, well, we'll get you out the door right there. Now, Tomislav, can you quickly build these? Let's see if we can't just get this room kind of done. Everything but that last square of granite that didn't get mined out yet. Otherwise, before Alicia sneaks away, can you bury Sam? Thank you. And then we have just Penguin left, and that's done. Tom Slav is going to have to be manually told to do this stuff because he is not going to want to do it because he wants to go to bed. So I'm going to just kind of ruin his day here. There you go. No, I 
didn't do it right. One more time. Do that. And then I can hold the shift button down. That's a little confusing. You're stacking them, but you're stacking them onto the after the one you don't want them to do. Alright, but otherwise it is really convenient to be able to do that. You used to have to just stand here and babysit them one square at a time. Boom, 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 boom. And the job is done. Alright. Kathra is refueling the stove. Thank you. Though I'd love to have one more grave done. Alicia, how bad off are you? You're, actually, your, your mood is great. That'll make up for a, a bad rest. So, yeah, let's have you, after you, no, you're resting now, okay. Then let's, Alicia, is that right? Yeah, I got that right. You construct that one, and then bury. Cannot order that one yet until the construction is done. Okay, so we'll have to babysit that one. Otherwise, after a day's charging, our batteries did not fill up. So we do have to think about doing the uh, another source of power. Probably plan that out while they're all sleeping. Uh, trained obedience. Oh, Sangria didn't go to, immediately to bed. Okay. And cleaning? Looks like it's not bad. Is that right there? I wonder if you'll do all the rest of the cleaning in there. I don't think it's very much. Otherwise... Right there, Alicia, you can next. Right there, Barry. And that is the last of the bodies. Except for the blood that's still out there. That is the end of that battle. Whew. Okay, Handy is going to bed before I catch her. Kathra is doing the same thing. Nobody is about to break. Needs, we're getting close. Let's kind of run through the cycle here. Who's the closest right now? Probably Shantigo, who is in bed and getting a bonus from resting. His beauty's going up. His comfort's up as far as it's going to go. Okay, Klaus is kind of low, but his, his rest and then a meal later will take care of him. So I think we're in decent condition right now. Natalia is getting joy from her work, and that's helping. Yeah. We're, oh, Miss P, you're still, you're still over here. <laughs> And no priority left because that's the last thing I ordered you to do. Otherwise, your rest is fine. Your joy's going up because you like mining. And, you know, if you're willing to stay out there, let's just, you know, cue these four up and let you make that decision. All right. Whew. That's all done. So, for the most part, except Alicia, who is just finishing off this one and burying whomever that was, Sherman... All the graves are in. And you are probably going to bed. Right there, resting. Okay. Animals are all heading in. And everything's going quiet. Except Ham. What's he doing? He is hauling silver to stockpile. And he's running really slow because of his permanent gunshot injury to the brain. So even though they normally go to bed at 2200, he's still trying to get to that silver. Now what can he haul? What is his... Uh, Capacity. He's going for the first one that's 35, but he'll stack... No, 35, 52. 52 is his max. Okay. All right, then. And Natalia finished something, some pants, and she's going to continue. She's grabbing... Looks like turkey? Yeah, turkey leather. All right. And there's more turkey sitting over here, which is starting to degrade, and some pig skin. Um, anybody else up? Alicia did make it to bed. And that's right. I don't want to switch it now, but I got to thinking. We could put Michael over here with Shantigo. And then Alicia can be down here. And another bed, another girl's dorm, we'll say. And that seems a, a better way to do that. Now, these two. I've been kind of thinking about our priorities right now. I really want to get into this. I want to get away from some of the other distractions for a while, though we do need to make sure to get at least a few traps laid out in here as they get the uh, the stockpile worked on. Maybe we can put a trap there and there since they've done hauling to this one. I guess we can put a trap there and there too. Um, otherwise, I'm thinking we've got a lot of characters. Winter's just starting. We've got to feed them all. Speaking of feeding, let me rabbit trail a moment here. I have been delaying Shantigo from cooking because I didn't want any more than 50 meals, and I got to thinking about that later. Why? Now, one disadvantage if we lose power, which we could, 
soon, since I didn't fully recharge, is that meals only have a couple of days worth of spoils in less than a day. Whereas raw ingredients will go much longer. Uh, these are frozen, but they'll, right here, potatoes outside, well, it's frozen outside. They'll go for, you know, a, a couple of quarters or quandrums, they call them here. Quandrums, yeah. Speaking of, it is 2nd of December-ary. december This december okay. This, um, Natalia is... She wiped out a t-shirt just like that. That's impressive. I have to say it is. Um, you're right there. Now you're going to work. That is your t-shirt. As soon as it hits the stockpile, that will go away. What just slid up? Oh, the boundaries. Okay. Um, so this has boundaries and the others don't. Hmm. Anyway, you drop that off. And we'll see that one fade out. Okay. Handy's up. Doing... Building a roof. Hmm. Hmm. Anyway, I feel like I've been uh, I've started three conversations that didn't finish a single one. Let's do this real quick. I'm going to I want to use Handy, so pause her for a moment. Bills. We don't well, do we want to stop at 50? Which means we can get all this process and be done with it and have lots of room. Or do we want to delay that and leave the stuff in the state that it will last the longest and have Shantigo do other things? Now that I'm thinking this through, I was I got in my notes to uh, make it unlimited, just let him just cook crazy and get it done. But we're satisfied right now, aren't we? Meals, 45. He's got a little more cooking and then he'll be done. We Let's leave it at 50 and make sure that he is set for mining as his backup. So Shantigo, because he liked mining. That's not what I wanted right there. Shantigo... Um, mining is right there. He is, um, 10 out of 20 with a burning passion. So that is his next now, right there. So hit the one, then his first two is right there. So that's going to be his next priority. Okay, I like that. I want to get into this. And setting more to mining is part of that. Another part of it is I'm going to let these guys go. I think we're going to get out of the prisoner recruitment business for a little while and wait for another batch to come in, which won't be long. Great that rimworld has been throwing raids and things at us, but Zoya, I think I'm going to let you go. Difficulty of 91 and Chucko. Um, Chucko needs a meal. Hmm. Though she's got plenty of mood to get off the map, that's really what the game wants. Let's do that. Let's set you also to release. Um, rabbits up. Needs. Really? It was, what, 11 p.m. when he went to bed and it's 3 in the morning and he's already raced through all that sleep? That's odd. Well, I guess he wasn't crashing at the point, at that point. He was just getting the trigger from this, that it was bedtime. Maybe that's what was going on. He didn't truly need it. Right there. Okay. Um, who can release them besides waking up Klaus? Is kind of where my, my thoughts are at the moment. Everybody can, but who will? Um, Handy, what was it I wanted you to do? I wanted some construction done. You were building a roof. Let's let you kind of do that real quick. We messed things up right here. And now you are going to build a grave. I'll just leave you alone. If you're willing to keep yourself busy, then I'll let you do it. Rabbit is hauling turkey meat in, which would be good. Um, for that matter, what is this? That's turkey meat 75. And that is berry 75. Somebody's filled that up. And Rabbit must be set for hauling. That's why he's doing all that. Rabbit, let's go ahead and release Zoya. Uh, releasing. And then when you're done, once you come over here and release Choco. If Choco can, can Choco leave the map when there's still some healing done? Healing to do. I think so. She's not... Boom. She's not incapable of walking. Uh, Bulkage Trader from the Rana of the River. So a caravan. Ah, so not a... A... Uh, Orbital. Okay. So a caravan from Ronald the River is approaching. They are a bulk goods trader, which means furniture and stuff, right? I think so. We still have more of that to get rid of. You guys are up here and look at the muffalos. You got great stuff with you. Is that a dead squirrel? 
That is a sleeping squirrel. <laughs> um, bolt goods trader. Okay. I did get these torn down in my my craziness of cleaning it all up so that table and whatnot was in there. These are poor quality and shoddy quality. And I also moved these two in place from over here. Real, just kind of sitting here staring at the map, figuring out what needed to be done and realized that, you know, beauty here is a negative 4.5 because of all the storage. And this is where they go to relax. That's not a good idea. So um, I moved it over to here where beauty is at least a positive number so that was torn down and this one could be hauled away rabbit we're going to stall you for a moment we're going to clear that we're going to have you haul that one away and that one's superior was there anything else that was shoddy that i don't really need that we've been waiting to tear down but it hasn't happened yet uh there's probably a few others but nothing i truly need to get done ah over here right here yeah so, uninstall, 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 uninstall. Okay, you're going to race through all of that because your mood and all of your stats are in great shape. All right, you're going to do that. Natalia won't take any of my orders because <laughs> she just wants to do her uh, her sewing job there. Chaco is fully healed. Good timing. And you're grabbing your own meal. That's what I wanted to see. Good. And Rabbit is still after Handy. <laughs> And Handy is building a heater, which we don't truly need right now. What can I get you to do toward the effort of getting ready for this bulk goods trader? Is there any more clothing to haul in? I don't think so. We've even down in the river, over in the river over here. Um, nobody was out over there. Nothing's left in the gauntlet. Okay, that's all done. How about you take over half of these? Why don't you work on that one instead and uh, that one instead. We'll let Rabbit do, still do reserve buy and reserve buy. Okay, the two of you can get those done, even though you probably just rebuffed the poor guy. Um, social attempted to woo and was rejected, and now he's taken a hit to his mood because he was rebuffed by Handy. Well, if he's smart, he won't try that again, but I instead accidentally didn't do it right again okay let's cancel the previous one by doing that first or even just completely there we go there and there all right the two of you can haul them in real quick anything else to get in place before our bulk goods trader gets here um, we could make sure that this stockpile zone is maxed out good and Klaus will be up soon to make the trade. So if we can get all this in place and ready for him, that would be wonderful. This never got moved. Hmm. Michael, what you doing? You're hunting a rat. After you... Hmm. Where's the rat? Which carnivore will want to devour you while you're doing that? You're racing up into here. And we've got a mess of a rat over here. Who health you apparently have been shooting at before. And it's right in the middle of all these these boomalopes. I'm kind of hesitant there. How are our carnivores while I'm at it? You, right there, needs... Now, your food is fine. Is the timber wolf still over here? No. Not there, not there. Um, where did he sneak off to? Interesting. Yep, he has moved on. There. Right there. Food, timber wolf. So those are fine. Hmm. I think I want to do something different, though. I want this moved. And unfortunately, you're going to bug Cathra. But she's going to be fine. She'll survive it. And interesting. The power needs didn't decrease that much overnight. Hmm. Hmm. I thought that'd be near zero. We're not losing as fast as I thought we were. Okay, by doing that, actually, you're already in here, so I don't think you can bug her anymore. I want this reinstalled right here. Like, hmm, I guess there. And, Michael, you're the perfect person to do it. Okay, and how about we cannot haul? You will never do hauling. All right. 
and before we oh you guys escaped uh 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 uh, uh. over here try it. you got them all down okay you're gonna haul that away then you're gonna haul that away and rabbit you are already doing it great you're gonna put that one away and then you're going to put this one away and we should be ready for a book full goods trader after that point good now what other conversations have I started and not finished? Got all that done. We need to move those eventually. Minor break risk is Shantigo. Because what? Because of all these negatives. Pain, barracks, rebuffed by Shantigo too? You guys will not leave her alone. After they marry, you'll still be after her. He's sick, he's disturbed sleep, feeling bad, ate without a table. Oh, life is horrible. Um, and going into an ugly environment. Hmm. Well, yeah. Okay. Tell you what, just get that job done right there. And then see if I can get you to just work at your cook stove where you will be happy as can be. You're digging at, refueling. Why can't you work? Oh, because the other trigger point. Okay. Let's eliminate that other trigger point right now, because this will give you a boost. Uh, find meals, unpause. Now, did that alter it permanently? No, it just paused when satisfied. It just temporarily eliminated, apparently. Okay. I didn't know that was there. Okay, well, we'll see what the long-term effect of that move was. You were doing what now? Digging out. Um, did I stack it? No. Well, let's try that again. Cooking. There you go. That'll make you happy. Now, Klaus is not in bed, so he's out here somewhere. Lice just came on. That's what I was waiting for. What is our use, assuming that everything is actually running? Outside, it is 28 degrees. In the hallway, it is 61, so this heater will be running. 61? Wow. I thought it'd be a little closer to the 70 that it's set at. This hallway is at 70. Okay. If I get rid of this door, let's do that. Let's deconstruct that. Zoya is leaving. Really? We just released her, like, right outside the door? Well, that's interesting. Klaus is going to release Chaco by letting her out the next door, is it? So, we, we, we've got... Now, at least you're taking her outside. Oh, you dumped her outside, and she went back inside, passed by all of our weapons. <laughs> and on the honor system, off she goes. Okay, so we're not in the prisoner business anymore. That's kind of a relief for me. So we're going to get rid of a few more little projects, and we're going to get to work over here. Um, but one of the things we got to do, and I keep talking about it but not getting to it, so I'm going to pause and do that because we're going to get busy here in a little bit. Power. We need more power. We need more sources. Um, we are... I only have a workload of only 1954. I thought it was 20-something when we were looking at it last episode. So some of the things aren't actually on right now. The freezer is 20 degrees, so this guy's not running at the moment. So he's just in... Well, power needed 200. I guess it has to get to 19 before it turns off. Okay. Um, well, there's something here that's not being used, and we need to add some more heaters. And we finally got the steel to build them. So we need a power source. All right there. What I'm thinking about is a wood-fired generator. And just to kind of see one more source of power. And this seems to be kind of our power source over here you know the, the area where we're creating our power it may be good to diversify it later I and mean, eventually we're going to get the uh the research done to be able to grab this the steam power here and here and we'll be pretty much set once that happens this goes where what is the reasoning for it we're not connected will you look at that all this time we don't have any blue bars between. Is that our next power source? Right there? Right under our nose and didn't know it was there? I thought that 5,000 watts that these three are making was kind of odd that it wasn't uh, overwhelming these batteries. The numbers didn't seem to work out right, but 
I wasn't going to argue. Rabbit, you are sewing area. Who? Handy is where? You are hauling like I asked you to do. Tomislav is hauling wood to wooden dining chair. Okay, after that, head over here and work on that. One of them should be enough. You'll bring materials for both. Okay, well, wow. By the end of this day, these batteries should max out again and we'll be fine. That's good to know. Klaus, you are in hauling mode right now. And actually, that one I would like to see in. So once that's done, Chantigo, where did you end up? Why are you not cooking? Meals, 52. You got your, your off point again. This will spoil in one day. This will spoil in 13 days. Chantigo is going to go do him some digging. All right, where to put Chantigo? Let's put him into here. And let's dig out this corridor right there. And as he goes, we'll go ahead and put some torches in and start lighting up our, our pathways during the construction. These guys are finally getting here. So Klaus, when you drop off those, let's go talk to them. Auto saving. All right. So we're going to talk to whom? Um, you're kind of buried in there. I think you're Darkling. Darklight? I'm going to spread out a little bit here. Trade with Darklight. Gotcha. Out of all that. Okay, so Klaus is going to go do that. Do we have everything in that we need to have in? Let's think about that real quick. Nothing's been dropped on the way. Everything's out of here. This could have been actually, you know, torn down. Didn't think about that. Well, we'll leave it forbidden for now. Okay. And let's see how much of this stuff we can sell. Boom. We're here. Okay. We are at almost a thousand silver now because we've been mining it. Okay, that's good. Which... I want some silver available for the uh, the, the hospital and the uh, uh, the kitchen coming up. Anyway, they have for us. Let's go that route. Boomalope meat. Dromedary meat. Raccoon warg. Got cloth over here. Hmm. Might think about that. Um, leather leather all right up in here they have herbal medicine that's too expensive they have steel and they have wood hmm we're almost done with our cancel pause let's think about this we've got cotton coming in growth rate of 35 percent grown and it has a growth uh um time of eight days so we're one third done with that so there's five and a half days left we'll be at least the five and a half days before we have the medical research done because we've been working on this well this is almost finished bills we're down to a toque left she'll be done in moments and then she'll jump back into uh, research probably after she goes to sleep she'll look at an order to go to sleep before too long okay so, no, we don't really need to buy cloth. I think we can handle it. If we, and let me just make myself a, well, I'll see this when I edit it. Make myself a note to uh, go through all the bills and turn off cotton on all of these so that cotton isn't used anymore for making clothes. We use the leathers and the wools, and we'll save the cotton for medicine production. All right, so with that, we don't need any of those so we don't really need meat either we're going to go after a herd of deer and i'm thinking these uh really big turkeys right here ostriches they have a fast run speed but i got to thinking last time so do we we're running at seven right now they're only running at six this is ostrich hunting season while they've got this this uh, fibrous mechanitis so yeah we we've, we've got lots of meat sitting out there so we don't need to buy meat we don't need to buy cloth so in that case klaus there right there and trade again with dark light and so we can skip pretty much everything they have for sale oh there's more down here okay so they have a shirt for sale they have a duster they have a shirt headdress toque and a headdress they've got a veil a scent thread war veil that's interesting. Must be like a war mask. Um, they've got a, they got a fennec fox skin cowboy hat. 
Ooh. And they've got a psychic foil helmet. Two of them. That's used for psychic events. And when you've got someone that is right on the verge of breaking and that you've got a psychic event going on that is really tipping the scale, it is really nice to have one of those. So I'm going to grab that. This is an animal bed. Don't need that. And a billiards table. And that is the end. So we'll buy that from them and that only. They've got a thousand available to them. Oh, good. All right, let's get rid of some stuff. What do we have to get rid of? Basically, everything that's a number over here. And the numbers over here that are... If you see any duplicates. not so, Venison. So we got some venison at... Well, that's interesting. A pile at a dollar nine and a pile at a dollar nine. When you get something that's like a pile at a dollar nine and a pile of you know, twenty nine cents, that means that pile is rotted and just about ready to be thrown away. May as well sell and get rid of it. But I'm not seeing. We got two corns, and they're not that extreme different. Um, so I'm not really seeing anything that that we've got that needs to be tossed food wise. So that's fine. Cloth. We've only got the five still. And tell you what, let's just get their cloth. They had 256. Let's just grab like 20. Something like that. Just in case timing works out such that we really could use it a little bit sooner. Otherwise, we have some hyper weave. We've got goat hide. Got lots of different hides. So we'll ignore all of these. Okay. Into here. We're keeping our herbals. We're not buying theirs. Steel be nice to get some the easy way but it's it's quite expensive time you add that up there's 500 silver right there just in that pile and 200 really doesn't go that far you know a couple of turrets and, and you're done um wood all right so we got stuff to sell them anything with a percentage we're going to toss out anything that does not have a percentage even though it's it's only say shoddy we're going to hang on to we can still wear it. It's still 100% quality, 100% uh, um, durability, we'll put it that way, left on it. Anything else here that's anything I should not be? That's right, there's a D. Somebody pointed out a while back, there's a D for one that has been worn by somebody who's dead, who had died. So we got rid of all of those clothes, which gives them a huge negative. They, they really get all creeped out if this was on a body. So get into the stuff that's not from that source. T-shirt, poor, but 89%. We can still wear that. I've set our threshold at 61% or higher. I'm going to hang on to that shirt. That means that's one less shirt that we have to make. And so that we can get Natalia off of making things and onto to uh, research. And I really want her researching. So we're not going to just be selling everything just for a source of income now. Um, otherwise, over here, what do we got? Uh, Tukes, 59%, and Ds. So we got more Ds over here. Interesting, it didn't pile them all together there. So that one, uh, three of these war masks, okay. And that one, okay. Further down here, uh, cowboy hat, bowler hats, fine. You guys, psychic foil helmet, that is theirs. I'm, I'm, I'm over here. No more Ds. Okay, what do we have here? We have a shoddy table. Thank you. And... I see, we're offsetting the 313 we spent on that psychic foil helmet, so we're still in the negatives right now. So let's see if we can at least break even. We've got a table for 10, poor quality, poor quality, awful. There's a good table, end table. I'm going to hang on to that one. And get rid of shoddies and pours. Right there. Got another pour down there. And we're about coming to the end. Yeah, we are. They won't buy these, darn. So we're not going to make back our full amount, are we? Um, marble double bed we're hanging on to. Another one right there. Though, do we need two of them? We could keep the excellent and sell the other one. There's no need for the other one right now. Sure. And we've got a good statue that we're not going to sell. And that's it. So out of all that, we traded all of our junk for a psychic foil helmet. And we only it only cost us 54 I'd say that is a decent deal, except, and pause. Psychic Foil Helmet is right there. Klaus really wants to do something. He wants to haul Granite Chunk to the dumping stockpile. And I want you to, after you put this away. So haul that one first. All right, so with that, Sangria, 
is consuming a fine meal. Good choice. And I think next, Tomislav's building that. So, this got built. Uh, let's look at it this way. Power. It got built. Now, how are we doing? So, now we are charging... We got 1,370 watts to the good right now. So we should see these guys get a full charge eh, maybe by the end of the day. We'll see how that works. They're, what, 1,000 each? They're 1,000 each. So not going up as fast as I would think. We'll see how it, We're at 9 in the morning. We'll see where we are in the afternoon. See if we still want to build a, another power source or not. You're bringing the muffalos through a hallway. Really? Last ones wanted to hover over here, too. Why is that? Is that kind of considered the center of our base? Right there? Kind of is. Klaus, you are hauling silver. Shantigo, you're digging at. Alicia, you're digging at. Okay, well, they won't be in here very much. We're going to hit these right here. I've been wanting to do this. I really have been. Um, Tomislav. You are relaxing socially. Needs? You don't really need it. Okay. Um, let's do something here. Let's work on that. And for that matter, let's come back in and architect and structure and granite block right there. After you're done, Tomislav, you're going to work on this one. Let's get these built. And in fact, let's do that again. Tomislav, cancel all those. And let's work on this one, then that one. Just in case that allows them to carry enough. Though it's... Yeah, 25 each. The very first trip. In case that just worked out weird and he's going to be forced to make two trips. And that's going to get done. And then, well, once I see it's done, we'll set that one to mine and, and get it done. And we'll have our own little back door to get into this area. Otherwise, as far as any other mining goes, we have a little bit of hiding over here. And I didn't queue these up. And that is it. The silver is done. I made a guess on where it ended, and it ended. Good. All right, so this area is pretty much mined out. So we're going to concentrate over in here now. And I sent Shantigo over here, didn't I? No, I canceled it by letting him do some cooking. Okay. Anyway, torches. Did they ever? They probably didn't. Didn't I set one in here somewhere? There, torch light. So that one could be built. This whole area. Is this where we want to start our, our digging? Get the bedrooms in here? Could be. It could be. Hmm. Let's. Orders. Plan. We know a hallway is going to go down and, and beyond. Let's mine this hallway. At least to two past. These bedrooms may extend further. I don't know. And we're going to get this built. Actually, let's do it all. So, mine out this pathway. Just extend it further down to there. Extend it down this way. Like so. And even... I won't, I won't extend it further. And then we'll go ahead and set the rest of these to mine as well. This is all going to be bedrooms. Eventually, this goes too. But I've got to make sure to maintain some support in here. In fact, I've got to maintain some support. Uh, cancel in... Let's kind of do that, that, that. There's some support columns in the middle of all this. Make sure nothing collapses on them. Um, then we'll get the bedrooms laid out. We'll get into the kitchen area. Yeah, I want to get into that. What a mess in there. Any other major priorities? Batteries, they are increasing. Okay, we'll see where they're going by the end of the day. Um, can I sit here and work on the work schedule without having to micromanage anything? I think so. Rabbit is... Hello, major pause. Raid? Really? Didn't we just kind of do that? Hmm. Where am I? 40 minutes into it. Hmm. That's never enough for a raid. All right. They will prepare for a while. The saber donkeys. Hmm. A group of pirates from the saber donkeys will have arrived nearby. They will prepare for a while. Jump to... They're coming in over here. We kind of did this once. Probably the same group. No, they were the saws last time. Though we have some superior run speeds right now. But you kind of messed up my, my plans of getting into building my base. 
Mm. I have not had much mercy on you guys now, I'll tell you that. Um, these were wood, these were granite. Okay, so granite for the actual pathways. Wondering why this got only partially built. They are saying hi. Alright, what is this all about? What is this nonsense? You're kind of stopping right here. Okay. Let's zoom in here and see what we've got. You've got something a little exciting. You've got frag grenades. Oh, you're so going to get sniped and take you down real fast. That looks like a shotgun. Pump shotgun. Yeah, revolver. There's a machine. No, that's a heavy SMG. Hmm. Giles has another shotgun. Um, what do we got over here? What's right there? That's a sniper, isn't it? That's a sniper. Do you know how to use it, comrade? Uh, needs, no. Character. Oh, man, you know how to use it. Oh, we've got a dangerous one there. Ouch. Hmm. Okay. Well, let's peek around a little bit more. We've got an auto pistol on someone who really knows how to use it, too. This is going to get a little more exciting than I'm really interested in. Giles knows how to use it. Risa, thankfully, does not. You don't even know which end to hold. You're not that bad. Same with you. And you are a wooden club and can't use it. You've got the incendiary launcher that we can't see it behind there. That guy's going to launch a rocket at us. And he, he at least knows which end of it to point. What is the green? Is that really a jade shiv? A jade shiv. Doesn't know how to use it, but wow, we're going to sell that thing. Hmm. We're going to sell that thing. You guys aren't into buying weapons, though. No. And you guys are who? The Rana of the River. Factions. Rana kind of likes us. They could help us, but they could also get killed and not like us for it. Hmm. A little complication there. And I feel like we had one more to look at. Soap. Eh, it can shoot a little bit. Okay. We got some danger in here. I really do. What do we do about that? I don't think we're going to go out sniping them. I really don't think that's a smart idea this time. We need to gauntlet these guys, and we have no traps in the gauntlets. We don't have much wood out here either. Okay. We've got some time. We're going to use every second of that time. Tomislav, new plan. I need you. Oh, that's all the wood we've got. Hmm. We've got some stored in here, right? We've got 15. Okay. Um, Rabbit, what are you doing? You're hauling wood. Thank you. I need you to do something entirely different. Okay. We need traps built. And don't have a lot of places to put them. I really don't. Okay. Trap. And we're going to build wooden ones. Uh, security. Trap. There. There. Can I get a turret in? I could get a turret in. I had them haul a lot of silver, a lot of steel. A little worried about it just yet. I haven't really thought about the uh, mechanics of it as far as being able to uh, not shoot us and where we're going to be standing in this huge sphere of influence when all this goes down, but we could do something like that. Too bad I can't get a little bit further over and take the rivers, too. Uh, it takes 175 silver and three uh, components. I think we need assistance this time. I think we're going to have to go for the turrets. You will aim all the way to here. So if I get you into here, actually, I get you just to right there. That's all I need to guard that. Now, for this direction, where is the advantage? Zoom out a little bit. In fact, Natalia wrote in today and told me that if I hit F11, it takes away the, the HUD. So I can see it a little more now. Interesting. I'll take the HUD off for a second. Um, this way, this way. Doesn't really make a difference up here. Does it make a difference down here? Uh, does it make a difference where we're going to stand? If I go here, I can get into the entire storage area in case we have bad guys hiding in here. 
Okay, there's that to think about. That covers the doors up in there in case they bust through a door and they're using this for cover. So I want to get into the doors, want to get into the storage. So that is probably where that goes. Right there. That's powered too. This one was not powered. Okay, so for the moment, hmm. Hate to add the task of building conduit, but let's do it. Uh, I need my HUD back. There. So F11 does that. In case you need to take a screenshot in this game and want to figure out how to get rid of all the all the garbledy gook along the outsides. Architect, power, conduit. You only need to get one, two, three, four, five, one, two, something like that distance away. So we can get to, well, we'll say here, which doesn't mean taking down a tree if I do it right there. Right? Yeah, that's clear. That's all clear, too. So I can head all the way through. Let's go up one, and then all the way through. That gives us power. We'll worry about switches later. We'll turn these off manually for the moment. That should get that power and get that power. Okay. Uh, 175. Is that what I saw? That's, that's a lot. 175, so 350. Wow. We've got 150... 313. Not quite enough here to do it. Yeah. I said once that I like to keep a thousand steel in reserve. I haven't been doing it on this Let's Play, but that is a, you know, you, you can go through a thousand steel really fast when a poison ship drops in right on you, and you've got to find some way to take it down, and you need defenses. Um... Let's concentrate on... Boy. Obviously, we're going to do this raid next episode. I'm at 45 minutes or more already. So I'm going to just kind of take this time to reason through it. Right there's that answer. Tomasov. Hmm. I was going to have you haul wood. Where is Handy right now? Handy is resting. Oh, man. Is she really needing it? She's kind of there. Handy is going to get started working on this one. Tomislav, I was back up in here when I thought about the turrets. Okay. Um, we want security and traps. Right there, 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 there. Both sides of that, both sides of this. Okay. That's 25 each, right? 70 each. Ow. Okay, our emergency wood supply is going to go away. I need these chopped. Now, I don't know how much time we've really got. I suspect we've got eight hours, maybe. We can do quite a bit in eight hours. We chop all this, we can get the traps done. Which means I could have Tomasov just haul in some of this. You're going to haul in some steel. Okay, so you're bringing in steel. And we got to get everybody micromanaged to do as much as they possibly can. Um, chopping trees is not a skill, so I can't figure out who's the best one to it. The best one right now is really the closest one. Uh, cutting stone blocks from chunk. Michael, you, you defaulted back to stone blocks. Let's default to here. Cannot. You will never do plant cutting. Mm hmm. But you will build... You no. Know, your construction level is too low to build a trap without being killed by it. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Klaus is hauling. Cather is hauling. Right. Hauling components. Hauling components. If I were to have you all drop them right here at Shantigo and then have one of you haul all these components, the other ones could immediately be put to work doing other things. Yeah, I like that better. Sangria is taking potatoes. No, we are no longer going to be taming. You're going to cut and cut and cut and cut. All right. And who else out here? Miss P needs your food is bad. Let's get you into eating. All right. Let's just go down the list. Tomislav, you are hauling steel. Handy, you are building. Rabbit, you are hauling that wood. I need you to stop what you're doing and build... Haul the wood, at least, to, to this trap right here. Okay, 
Will you grab that stack or we do something really crazy and grab the, you know, the wood that's sitting over here or something? Okay, you did do that. All right, rabbit, Shantigo, you are digging out. Okay, what can I get you to do? Your mood's fine. Um, run speed was decent, fives. Okay, so Shantigo, let's have you work on that one. That one. That one. And I want to make sure I did that right. Sangria is not going to do training in between. Okay, good. So next one in line, Klaus, you are hauling components. That's right, you're down there, that group. Okay, so Sangria is done. Catherine is with Klaus. Natalia is sleeping. Michael refuses to do anything I want him to do, and he wants a block cut. What can we default that to? Michael, there, and character. What can I get you to do? You can't build any of our defenses right now. Is there anything else to build that you can haul? No, you wouldn't. You cannot haul. I want to get more stones into there. Um, let's think here. You can mine. That won't help. You can make blocks. Hmm. Okay. Can you rest? You can eat. You can eat. Let's do that. All right. Get you at least your mood up a little bit higher for the battle that is going to happen. Okay, so we got as far as Michael. Miss P, you are consuming a fine meal. You were in bed, that's right. And Alicia is digging a compacted machinery. She is willing to do anything. All right, Alicia, come on up here and cut the rest of these trees. I need all the wood I can get. So you're going to do this one, and then I think these two are still available. Yeah, do those right there. All right, the last thing I wanted to micromanage was these two walking over to here. And stop, Klaus. Uh, draft. And if I were to do that, you will want to haul. Okay, so I'm going to leave you there. Like, Actually, haul this one. That will get it, the job done faster. You're going to go there. You're going to drop off right there. And stop. Kathra, you're going to drop. Klaus, you're going to pick up all of these. And Kathra, you are going to... And Alicia, no. So, Kathra, what are you going to do that's going to save our bacon here? Your construction is not very high, is it? No, that won't work. Okay. So, where am I? Kathra, what to get you to do? And then I've got to shut this one down. Um, you can haul. You can haul. Let's have you haul. I need some some limestone just kind of hanging around. These are defenses. Don't have any. Hmm. I'll tell you what. Just from a doorbell ring, so I've got to get going, see who is at the door. But in between this and the next episode, I'm going to build the fences a little bit and kind of get ready for the battle as much as I can until they break, and then we'll, we'll tune back in next episode. So it's been uh, Noble Rambler, and... I'll catch you next time, folks. Bye-bye.